Hello and welcome back to Vintage Treasures and today we're going to be looking at a last action hero evil gift set and this includes Evil Eye Benedict and the Evil Eye Roadster. Now what I'm guessing this is, I don't really have too much context, is this was probably sold around Christmas and if you were someone's aunt or a grandma or a grandpa or something, and you were in a store and had no idea what to get your grandchild or your niece or nephew, this is it. Now one thing that is very crucial to toy business, uh, not in this case because the kid's not the one buying it, is the box. Now this is the most generic box I've ever seen. It's white, instructions, all you know is what it's from, what's in it, what company made it, and that's it. White, barcode, consumer information, same thing from the front, uh, run number, that's it. That's all you're getting. And this is something that's probably sold to aunts and uncles and stuff like that uh, to give to their nieces and nephews, so I don't think the box is too important in that stance, but as a toy collector, I think it would be better if it had a cool box. Now, doing a little bit of research into what this is, because I'm not uh, very big in The Last Action Hero, what I've read from it is it's a movie from, it's a vintage movie, of course, because uh, toy's vintage, uh, and it had a toy line, obviously. And one of the characters was Evil Eye Benedict, which is the figure in this playset. Now the thing that I noticed is he would be sold on a card, and this would be sold in a box that was better looking than this box. But you're getting two things in here. So I'm guessing there was a price cut a little bit. You probably paid, I don't know, 20 25 for this instead of, well, I don't know inflation you know I, I'm not gonna say anything as far as that goes I'm not very good with math but this thing's cool and it's new so I'm not gonna be opening the individual bags because it's new uh, but I'll show you what's in here so let's get started oh got a little bit of stuff here there's the roadster and this is what comes out of the box. Uh, basically what you'd get out of the box if you were to buy uh, the car. But as far as the figure goes, which I'll show you later, uh, this would come on card like a Ninja Turtle or a Dick Tracy figure. Uh, so yeah, let's start with the car, which I'm not going to open again. But you can see pretty well. This thing's in mint condition. It's got this thing in the front. You could shoot this missile out. And here's those eye stickers for the headlights. Oh, this thing looks cool when it's all put together. I might put it together when I get a uh, bigger space, which, I don't know, may happen one day. I'm not in a rush. Uh, the bottom is detailed with uh, mechanic stuff in it. Of course, we got the wheels that move. These little exhaust bits at the end, which disattach. Making the car bigger. I guess you can hit someone down with that. Uh, of course, the engine just clicks. I think that's how you shoot the missile. And overall, just a cool looking car. There's the instructions in there. Now, moving on to accessories. I'm going to take these out of the package because it's just a little piece of. Oh, well, it actually just broke. Old tape. So, we're going to take a look at the briefcase and the other things in this bag. We'll start off with this briefcase. Let me turn my light up just to show you something. This has a elephant print on it, which is probably very hard to achieve in mass production. Uh, plastic molding. But it looks great. It looks like a briefcase. I don't know how to open this thing, and I don't want to break it, so I'll put that to the side. Uh, we got a couple of uh, blasters, we'll call them, for YouTube's sake. Three blasters, 
and this one has a nice uh, extended tip. Seems to be a revolver. And these are bullets, which I don't really get. I think these are bullets, at least. I, I, those are very small. But these are bullets, I think. But it doesn't make sense, first of all, because they're white. Second of all, because they're small. And the guns aren't, I mean, the shooters aren't operatable. So that doesn't really make sense to me. While I was putting the stuff back, I heard... You hear that? Something shaking there, so I will open this briefcase. Okay, I got it, and the payoff was massive. We got some stickers. I'm guessing... I don't know what these are for, actually. Maybe the outside of the briefcase? I'm not sure. And... Kind of reminds me of Detective uh, Donatello, or Undercover Donatello. Is that Detective Donatello? Having a brain fart, sorry. It reminds me of that with the stickers with the cool uh, prints on it. Let's move on to the best thing in here, by my opinion. Evil Eye Benedict. Oh, look at that suit. You know what it's reminding me of? It's reminding me of the bad guy from uh, Master Disguise. I think this bag is actually open, so we can take an even closer look at him. That's nice to see that nice cream color. This is vintage, and if you know anything about anything that's white uh, or cream colored in any vintage toy, it fades bad and unevenly, so the chest would be a different color than the arms and the legs. This is pristine condition. Jeez. Looks like we got one. This one, this figure's from... camera doesn't want to work today but I promise you it's from 1993 awesome paint of course because it's brand new I mean it's crazy to think how new this thing is it's never really seen the light of day now if you enjoyed today's video please consider liking the video and uh, consider subscribing because I upload content like this all the time right now it's once a week every Wednesday I post uh, unless, you know, something comes up, I might post twice a week, you know. It just depends on my schedule. But I, I as of right now, I strictly post every week. Uh, if you enjoyed today's video, of course, uh, consider subscribing. Uh, it's free. It's free to unsubscribe if you change your mind later. Uh, if you If you want to, you don't have to subscribe. I mean, there's plenty of options, you know. You don't even have to subscribe. You can subscribe later. It doesn't matter. It's all the same to me. Uh, yeah, but have a great rest of your day or night, and goodbye.